Hello friends and welcome back to our next installment of Sensory September. I'm Anne, I'm the Youth Services Librarian here at the Octavia Flynn Public Library in Gallup, New Mexico. And today we are doing tissue paper process art. So process art is where you care more about the process and the final product. So things that fall under this category would be things like finger painting, playing with Play-Doh, things that help strengthen our fine motor skills but aren't necessarily pin hinged on everything looking perfect at the end. So let's get started. So for this activity, you're going to need a piece of styrofoam, um, a dowel, a paintbrush, a end of a pencil, something to poke the tissue paper in with, and of course, tissue paper. So I'm going to take the dowel I have here and poke some holes into my styrofoam, and then poke in different colors of tissue paper uh, as I go. Uh, this is an exercise meant to help with things like fine motor skills. If you've got kids learning how to hold pencils and other things like that, this is a great activity for that. Um, again, this is about the process, not about the end product. So don't worry too much about how things look. Just kind of let them play around. Other good process activities are things like Play-Doh and finger paints um, and other things like that where it's more about getting your hands dirty and using your hands than it is about what the, what the end product looks like. And I hope you guys try it at home. And if you do, uh, take some pictures and tag us on Facebook or Instagram at Gallup Library uh, so that we can see all of your great creations. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.